So Power. First, plug it in. Plug it in. And then you cut it. Wait, what? Are you serious? Uh, uh, wait, are you serious? No. <laughs> I'm so confused. Since when does Dan make funny jokes? This is so confusing. Best day ever, we just destroyed lava lamps with what's inside. Look at this guy. We dropped a GoPro inside of it, splashed everywhere, and then you saw the bubbles like bubbling up. And we also shot the hot lava into this cold water and it turns into this weird <laughs> design right here. Lincoln, was it fun? Yeah, I loved it. It's so much fun destroying five. it too. Yeah, oh, I just better high five. I, I is that one, one more high five? There, oh, that was a good high five. So now what we are doing is creating a monster lava lamp out of this guy. Step one, find a giant container. I might not recommend going straight to six gallons. This is a little ambitious, maybe. Step two, oh, I almost <laughs> broke the light bulb. Step three, don't break the light bulb. So we're gonna use the wax, yes? What do you yeah, think, Yeah, we need the wax, but if the wax is cold and hard like this one is, it's just, you can't really fit it in the hole there. So we're gonna try to take the hot lava and dump it in there. All right, let's let's uh, let's start the process. Let's start making this monster. Ready? All this. Okay, I'm gonna hold this because it's kind of shaky. Okay. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Oh, this is such a good idea. Let's keep doing it. I feel like I'm doing, oh, what's that thing? Dr. Dreadful. Did you ever know what that was? It was like a little like make it. It was like an easy bake oven for boys. And I got a D in science class. Look at this. My science teacher would be so proud of me right now. This is how you make the, the hot lava heat up from the light. Should we put these coils in there too, do you think? I think we go with the scientist here. Dan? Yes. Did Dan just talk on the board? Dan, he, he didn't, yeah, okay. Dan great. said yes. Okay, <laughs> coils in, next up. Mother! Oh. Holy! Oh, yes, it didn't break! Oh. Okay, what happened? Nothing. Oh, nothing. Oh, we're good. <laughs> Go upstairs, oh, nothing's doing? happening. I heard holy from clear upstairs. <laughs> Come look, tell me what you think so far. What is this though, like what's on here? Liquid magma. No more screaming. Dill. No more screaming holy. Dill, bye. All right, that was a close one. <laughs> Step four or five, whatever we're on, do science experiments when your wife's not home. It's going down in there. I feel like I'm like, I just cracked eggs and the yolks oh. are going into Ew. That one stinks. Ew. I got water on me. It's not water, it's liquid magma. This oh, is yeah. the How are we gonna get that wax out? We're gonna have to just break this guy. Okay. What's an easy way to break this? Over the toilet! <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Where does that even come from? Or over your garbage can, put the metal tray in there, bang it against it. Yeah, I, I'll figure it out. BRB! Oh, there you are. <laughs> We're like, the lava lamp is broken, don't worry! Step seven, curb stomp the lava lamp. <laughs> Step nine, break the wax into small enough pieces to go inside of there. And then put the purple turd in there. Step 10, don't do this on carpet. After watching this, everybody's gonna wanna make their own I know. lava lamp. This part right Step here. Step 14, do it for the lava lamp. Step like, step like 16, clean up your workspace because a dirty workspace is dangerous. All right, step like 19 or something, Dan, what are you doing? Putting the seven inch legs on this platform. So this is gonna be the platform the lava lamp will sit on. We have the legs to raise it up, and then underneath will be the 250 watt light bulb. All right, what did you just make? I screwed a box to a board. What did you just make in a not sarcastic way? I made a box screwed to a board. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? So this is the wiring for the heat lamp. So in the time that Dan has almost constructed a functioning light bulb from a power strip, this Dan has put two legs onto a piece of metal. I'm really fast at destroying stuff, but I cannot build stuff. <laughs> You're doing great. Boom. Is that looking good? And then we'll put the lava lamp on here. Dan, do we have your approval? It needs to be like twice as high. Twice? Wait, are you serious? Yeah. What if we stack it on a whole bunch of video games? <laughs> Old like fashioned games. Yeah, that's, that yeah that's, that's a bad idea. <laughs> Boxes of Red Bull. <laughs> Dan, does this have your seal of approval? 
It's a start. Mm. Okay. Step number 37. Put Red Bull boxes under your lava lamp structure. Hot lava lamp contraption built thus far. In a picture of this, this is actually really cool. Yeah. Hashtag Red Bull, hashtag ad, hashtag sponsored, hashtag Red Bull. Dan, what's going on? Wait, what's that? Super glue? It's a super glue. Why extension. is there an open water bottle right here? So I got the wrong size of quarter grips because I didn't know what size of extension cord we are using, so... <laughs> Idiot, I would have got the right size. Okay, <laughs> continue. <laughs> so I have to super glue it in there, and water actually makes super glue harden immediately, so... The more you know, you hear that? Check out the sticker. Pull up your computer. Dude, that's sick. rad. Why don't I have Shondura stickers? Okay, if you guys think Shondura stickers need to happen, write in the comments because they need to happen. <laughs> I think Shondura stickers need to happen. Moment of truth. We're okay, going to see if the light off. bulb turns on. Wait. Oh! Yeah. Step 51. The light works. <laughs> Step 88. We are going to fill up the monster lava lamp with water. All right, I think that's how full that we're going to fill it. <laughs> now it's a lava lamp. We are going to let this sit, give it um, a couple minutes. Oh look, it's starting to work like there's a little bubble right there. I think, I'm starting to feel like 7.5 out of 10 success ratio. It's looking possible. That's way better um, than before. What were you, yeah, three? Three. It was three before. Okay. <laughs> wow. While it's heating up and we wait to see if this is going to work, there's actually an easier way to make your own homemade lava lamp. So we're going to show you how to do that really quick. It's fun. It's fast. You could do it for a science fair project, a homemade volcano, whatever. So we're going to do that right now. And then when we're done, we'll see if this guy is working, so stick around. We've been talking about this guy. We've come to this conclusion. This chunk see right here? This? Yeah. This is supposed to be only go up when it's completely gel and hot and fire molten lava, but it's a big old chunk of it's, hard, cold it's wax. It's still solid. Basically, the water, the liquid we have in here is more dense than the wax, even when it's cold. So I think we're going to run the store, get rubbing alcohol, mix it with the water, hopefully make the water less dense, and then the liquid will work correctly. So basically, Dan's going on an alcohol run. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, welcome to how to build a lava lamp out of stuff in your kitchen. You pour water. You pour water first? Yes. How high do we want to go? Way high, bro. No, about right. Actually, that's good. Next step, you want to get a little bit of Canola. Canola oil. oil. You know, a little bit goes a long way with this guy. Oh, that's... And stop and watch it, because it goes, keeps going. We need less water. We need, like, that much water and the whole rest of it to be canola oil. I it's swear it should be, like, mostly canola oil with a little bit of water, and then the water that has food coloring in it, like, mixes around. I think I'm right and you're wrong, and if that's true, then I will die happy. Okay, actually, yeah, uh, you are. I read it wrong. <laughs> Okay. Forget this project, we did it wrong. Yeah. Restart. <laughs> Welcome back. Now we know how to make this and we're gonna show you it's easy. But you wanna start out with a little bit of water. That's good. Water is more dense than canola oil, so the water will stay on the bottom and the rest of the lava lamp will be canola oil. Uh, that's too much. <laughs> Holy. No, <clears throat> uh, dump out a little more. So we've got our uh, food, food coloring. coloring. Many drops we want to do. Let's do... Um, just do like nine. Yeah, there we go. So they go to the bottom, eventually they'll make contact with the water, and... Oh, oh did you see oh, that? Check that out. Boom! Look at that. Was Let's I right or was I right? Boom. We can actually put it in the lava lamp fixture if we'd like. Boom, look at that beautiful lava lamp. Now the way you get this lava lamp to work is Alka-Seltzer. What is Alka-Seltzer even used for except for like weird science projects? Yeah, yeah seriously. I like, like I legitimately don't know what Alka-Seltzer is used for except for fun. Three, two, one, go. Lava lamp. Well, let's, let's leave it yeah, right there okay. for now. Yep. Oh, look at that lava lamp. Beautiful. That's actually really cool. It's growing. Oh boy. <laughs> get the, get the, okay, we got this, we got this. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah, 
You can do that in less than five minutes. See? Or you can make this in seven hours. <laughs> <laughs> so we left you guys off before we started this one. We said the water in this was too dense. So Dan went on the alcohol run and... I don't know how much Dan wants me to get, but hopefully that's enough. Are you making tennis ball cannons? Am I making what? Tennis ball cannons. Tennis ball cannons would be cool, but no. A giant lava lamp. Ah, oh, sweet. I bought every single 91% alcohol that Walmart had. We're gonna put it in, thin out the water, and hopefully get that wax to sink. And then as it heats up, it'll bubble to the top, then sink again, and we'll have a monster lava lamp. Oh, this is such a bad idea. Wait, in the sink, are you guys serious? Toilet, toilet. I feel pretty good about it now. What are you guys doing? It's not even hot. All right, rubbing alcohol has been inserted. Slightly hopeful. Dan, what do you think? Two out of 10. Dan? So you were a three, you went to a seven, now where are you at? I'm at like a four. <laughs> <laughs> three and a half. A nine, because it looks like so gross and cool with all the <laughs> So what's this switch though? This switch turns the light on. It's Dan, not... could we try and be a little bit more specific? When you flip it, the light turns on. <laughs> <You did. laughs>